Hey, what's up guys? The Japanese consumer electronics brand Sharp has released a new Android flagship named Equas 02. It is a direct successor to the Sharp Equas 0 which was launched last year. Now, this phone grabbed my attention because it has few unique features. One of them is regarding display. Can you guess what it is? Okay, let me give you a hint. Refresh rate. Yes, it has a higher refresh rate. It's not 90Hz, not even 120Hz, but it's 240Hz refresh rate panel. This is double of current best offering like the ASUS ROG Phone 2, so it would be interesting to see how it fares in real life. The display comes with a full HD plus resolution with OLED technology and a water drop notch for the selfie camera. There's an in-display fingerprint reader as well. Sharp is also proud to announce that it's the lightest phone which weighs just 143 grams. Under the hood, the Aquas 02 packs the Snapdragon 855 chipset paired with 8GB of LPDDR4X RAM and 256GB of UFS 3.0 storage, though there are no details about microSD card support. As far as the cameras are concerned, the Sharp Aquas 02 on the rear packs a 12.2 megapixel primary camera with an f1.7 aperture and a second 20.1 megapixel camera with an f2.4 aperture with 125 degree field of view. The rear camera setup has autofocus as well. It supports an 8 megapixel camera on the front for selfie. So camera wise, there is no upgrade like 48 megapixel or 64 megapixel sensors. But then again, megapixels are not everything. Oddly enough, the Sharp Aquas 02 features the same battery size as the Aquas 0 that is 3130 mAh battery which is less considering today's battery standards and this is partly the reason why the phone is so lightweight. The device boots Android 10 out of the box which makes it first such smartphone in the world and thus beating upcoming OnePlus 7T series to claim this title. It also offers NFC support, face recognition unlocking and also has IPX5, IPX8 and IP6X water and dust proof. It will be available in astro black and misty white color but there is still no word on pricing. The phone will be available starting December. And that's the information we have about this device. Did you like it? If you are interested, then do subscribe. See you in the next one. Peace out.